The inferno, back in April 2019, was devastating, tearing through the interior of the church, consuming 800 years of history in minutes. Four years on, to see how far the restoration has come, the Today Show has been given special access, going 300 feet straight up to a tiny exposed platform with spectacular views of Paris. Philippe, bonjour. Meet bonjour. Philippe Jost, overseeing this mammoth project. So this is the spire that went crashing down. It's actually, we all watched it all around the world. All around the world. Oh my God, these people just fell inside the church. Oh my God. So oh my God. it's a very important moment when now the spire is rebuilt. And this is the golden rooster. It's fantastic. We're very happy to have done that. The original rooster weather vane was thought lost, but miraculously survived, buried in the ash. And just last weekend, this new rooster was blessed and placed gently on its perch. It contains holy relics, pieces of what is said to be the crown of thorns. It was a very, very uh, emotional moment and uh, symbolic moment. It's a phoenix from the ashes. Exactly. Yeah. Or, I... or a rooster from the ashes. <laughs> now Philippe and I descend into the nave, the heart of Notre Dame. There was a hole in the ceiling. A, a big hole in the ceiling. Just a year before the fire, today toured the ageing cathedral and its wooden roof. Now it's being rebuilt better, with advanced fire protection, while expert carpenters use medieval tools, slotting roof timbers together like a giant puzzle. A lot of people have given a lot for this, including many people donating from the US. Uh, $30 million. $30 million. $30 million. Donations that are helping to reveal more of the cathedral's wonders, the vivid colors of priceless masterpieces brought back to life. Ancient wood and stone clean. And these statues, rescued from the fire, have been lovingly revived. New gargoyles are being sculpted and will soon take their place high on the walls of this, the most famous cathedral in the world. I mean, it's just remarkable on so many levels, Kier. The speed with which they have completed that restoration. Yeah. Any idea at this point when, when it's going to be ready for us to actually visit? For those of us who celebrate, Craig, Christmas next year, Christmas Mass in Notre Dame Cathedral 2024. Uh, how about that? It won't be ready to go into for the Olympics itself during the summer, but all of that scaffolding, which is itself uh, an amazing engineering feat, that will be gone, which is kind of a shame because it's a great view of the opening ceremony on the Seine from up there. Mm, I would imagine so. Uh, great still, story. still, I mean, yeah. it's great. I remember when you covered it, the pictures were devastating. Yeah. yeah. The fact that they brought it back so quick. Remarkable. Kier, yeah. thank you. Thank you, my friend. Merry Christmas. Merry to Christmas, you as well. Kier. Hey, thanks for watching. Don't miss the Today Show every weekday at 11 a.m. Eastern, 8 Pacific, on our streaming channel, Today All Day. To watch, head to today.com slash all day or click the link right here.